Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome to a brand new series on a game called Cities Skylines. City Skylines is a modern take on the classic city building simulation game. It introduces a new gameplay elements to realize the thrill and hardships of creating and maintaining a real city whilst expanding on some well-established tropes of the city building experience. What does that mean? Well, that's just what the Steam page says, so I'm reading it. Uh, the game is developed by Colossal Order, who you may recognize from the Cities in Motion. Uh, that game, they're the same developer team on that, Cities in Motion 1 and 2, and this one's kind of a new game, uh, kind of a new system, a new setting on it. I'm really excited to play this. They were kind enough to give me a key so we could do a little bit of an early, uh, early series on it. So we're going to rock and roll on this. The game, it has a maximum uh, population, city population of 1 million people. So that's going to kind of be the goal of the city is to get our city up to that 1 million part. We're going to do some uh, some fun things through it. They have the fully integrated Steam Workshop. The game is heavily moddable. Uh, there's the content manager here that we can delete all these other things. We can share the things that we've built, our save games, our assets, all the mods that we've created. Hard money, unlimited money, that's already on the game uh, built in. So if we wanted unlimited money, we could do that. For the case that we're going with, we're not. We're just going to play the vanilla right now, the basic game, the basic new game. Uh, we're going to start out, and there's a whole bunch of different maps that we can pick. We have River Run, the Green Plains, we have Islands. This one seems kind of cool. You build like different cities on the islands. Uh, we have Shady Strands. You can see down here there's different resources, oil, ore. Uh, this is farming and then forestry. And then uh, we have two rivers down here. There's different rivers in there. Sandy Beach, Diamond Coast. That sounds really cool. And then this one I played when I was testing out the game, Lagoon Shore. This is like a, a tropical beach. Reminded me of maybe a, a Tropico uh, sort of game if you played that. Uh, so what I'm going to do is actually go into the islands. That sounds fun to me right now. And we're going to rock and roll. There's outside connections here. We're going to go on right side traffic because that's how I kind of drive on the, the right side of the road. So we're going to start and we're not going to click the left side. And we're popping into the game. It's generating our map loading up here. And we should be in here any second now. It goes pretty quick and we'll see our initial screen as soon as this comes up. There we go. Hello. Let's start building me some roads and zoning the areas and let them build. Uh, buildings will spawn in the zoned areas, a lot, a lot, a lot. That is pretty neat. Um, and that's pretty basic. Middle click allows you to rotate around. WASD is panning. And then we have our little area here. You can see this is actually a nice big bridge that goes across. Uh, there's another area here. This is our zone that we can go in, this uh, box area. That's where we can rock and roll. And there is a, looks like a little ore, a little mountainside that we could develop on and do other things. We can build roads, attach it to here, and I guess we should maybe just get going. This is the main interstate that goes through. That isn't that a beautiful little bridge. I can't quite pan to it yet, but we'll unlock in the future. We'll be able to unlock more of the map. Uh, this is the main map screen. And this game, it uh, one of the, the selling points on the game is they want it to be huge. They want you to be able to build massive cities without really having a, a barrier. The, the million person barrier is, it's kind of, I mean, it's, it's there in the game, but that's more of a simulation. Uh, each of the, the characters and the personnel are individual simulations, so it kind of bogs it down. But uh, a million people is still quite big, but that map we're allowed to go and expand however we want to. If we want to come over here in these mountains, we can. If we want to go out on these islands, we're good to do that. So, let's get started. Let's rock and roll. We get down here at the bottom, we get to build roads. We're going to start out, we're in level 1. We don't get very much. We don't have anything to start with. So we have the roads. We have a two-lane road. We don't have any of these unlocked yet. They require a little more people, a little more money, and things that we'll get in the future here. So let's start. We have our in and our any and outy. <laughs> innies and outies. This is the leading out of the city up into the interstate, and this is leading into the city from the interstate. So what I want to do is I kind of want to like connect these two. I know it's a little bit hard to do that to begin with, and then we're going to go a little bit further on both sides. Uh, you can see we have, that is a construction cost of 400. That's kind of like one city block, kind of. And we're going to do two out on each, and then we're going to take this, and we're going to go down I kind of want to do like two different areas to start with. This one will be 2,000, and we'll go 2,000 by 2,000, uh, 2,000 cost that is. 
and then we'll go back up here to 2,000. Aha, uh -huh. and we'll come back this way. So we now have a city block that is 2,000 by 2,000 uh, credits worth. I guess it's how many blocks it is. We'll connect these. Okay, look at that. And we'll do, we'll do like that here, and we'll do that. And then we'll kind of mix it up. How's that sound? Pop in down this way. Kind of, kind of nice to be square, but on the other hand, you want it a little bit mixed up. And then we could do, we could leave that in the middle, kind of nice, or we can come back in here, and if I can click right, there we go, and we'll do one more. You can see we can also do curved roads. We'll do that in the future. So that's going to be our main, our main city block to begin with. Down here we have our zoning laws. We can do a low density residential. So we'll pop that in right there. That'll be perfect. And then we can do like there and there and there. We'll do that to begin with. This this middle area we don't want to quite uh, quite what zone yet. We don't want to develop that yet until we have some more things put up in the game. So we're gonna get our houses first. Every good house needs wonderful electricity. And we also need water and wastewater. So we have water pump and we have wastewater pumps. We'll get into that. Let's do the water or the, the electricity first. So we can start with a coal fired power plant. It costs us 19,000 monies. We have 51,000 uh, monies right now. So we could maybe start with a coal plant. It does cause a little bit of pollution and noise pollution, whereas the uh, wind turbines just cause noise pollution. I don't really like the ground pollution in the game because it actually makes the game look ugly. So we're going to start brand new with this. Um, and then this is a different heat map of different things that it's allowed. Keep in mind that wind turbines power output depends on the wind velocity. You can see strong winds as dark blue areas on the map and establish power output next to wind turbine by placing it. So we can actually make 8 megawatts there, whereas up here we can make 2 megawatts. So it'd be a good idea to go right along here and pop in some wonderful little wind turbines. Let's do that. That's seven, we need, to, we need to maximize, let's get eight. And we'll pop in two of these. So this is the area that's actually powered right here. Uh, if we go back into that, this little blue box is what's actually powered. So if we run power lines, we can pop over and we can pop up next to the map, right there. We'll go over and then these should work out nicely. So that should power it. Uh, as soon as these start getting developed, actually we need to zone that other thing, don't we? Let's zone that as commercial. Get a little bit of little bit of sales as our main entry there. Oh, we can do one here too, like a, a toll booth. A little bit of the toll booth going inside. And now let's let's un let's clear that one. And clear that one. Good. We placed it where we don't want it. We can always delete these things too. But I'm not going to yet. We we might in the future. Who knows? So we have our wind turbines. I have everything paused. There they are. We can turn them on. Aha! Congratulations! The first power plant has been built. Yeah, are you gonna kind of rotate? There you go! Look at him go! There, that's so cool. Aha! Green energy, what an excellent choice. Yeah, that's what I can afford. Thank you. Go away, little bird. So, next up on the list, we actually have some houses coming in. Look at that. Haha! <laughs> the pine residents, they don't like it because they don't have electricity or water yet. So, let's get some water going. Well, we can do water pumps. And we have water coming this way. The water is actually flowing downstream. It's also flowing downstream over here. Let's do let's do a little bit of water coming in right here. We want it upstream as most we can. We'll do one right now. We also need to rock and roll with the piping system. So let's come over here. Kind of mimic where the electric electrics electricity whatever that word is. We'll pop in like a so. And we'll go over over like a here. Oh, is that straight? Kind of. Let's go up a little bit more. Ha! And we'll come this way. We'll go right under our roads. Oh, that's a little bit off, isn't it? Shoot. Okay, let's just do that then. All right. Let's get most of our little town up and active. You're, you're not going to go straight on me, are you? Hey, hey. Come on. You. Uh... We'll make a nice system. Something is wonky. That's okay, we don't see this anyway. Will you get all of our water going? Well, that's going to be a little short, too. Ugh. Make a double line. Don't want to waste too much money building a bunch of that. And we also need to get a water drain pipe. So I want... This is going to be our exit zone for all of the water. Hey. Hey, hey you. Why? Why can't you work on me? Oh, because it was outside my city limits. So we'll pop it in 
right here. You can see that little box interacts with the outside. We'll pop that in and we need to make our wastewater attach. So we're going to come across the top and we'll come back down. That should be good. This also needs power. Motor of the electrics. So we'll run... Hmm, where do I want to run this? Should we just, just go blank right across? Yes. Blank right across. Alright, that's ugly. Let's That'd be fine. Cool. So, uh, economy panel is unlocked. We can look at that. We are making a little money on water and electricity, but that doesn't matter right now. So let's let's resume. Hooray! The water pumping station has been constructed. Hashtag fresh water. Hashtag mayor rocks. That's us. We're mayor and we rock. Look at these little houses. This is my favorite part of the game. The actual building simulation. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Look at it go. They're popping up. I was like doggy barking. Did you hear the puppy? Oh, there's someone over here. Is that a cow? That's a buffalo. What is a buffalo doing running around in our town? It does. Hey! Bison. Go, Bison. Yes, NDSU, Bison. North Dakota State. So he's pinned. Uh, he's eating. Or a, a bison? Bison. Yes. Buffalo. Buffalo. Yeah, he's a buffalo now. He's not a bison. Okay, so we're out of power down here. We have no electricity because nothing has been brought down. We're going to have to drag some power lines over here too. We'll just pop it in in this corner. Drag it all the way over. Connect. A little bit wonky. Hi. Uh, yes, hello. Would you like to come over and give me some power? Right here? No, you're kind of on getting on my nerves here a little bit. Okay. There we go. Now they should have power. Power. Go away. There they go. Power is turning on. Water is fine. We're getting people moving in. I think that's what it means. Look at that. We're leveling up. And it's wonderful. Ooh, we're getting our first commercial building. Check this out. This is the general store. Not enough electricity. You should be fine on the electrics. This will come over and get you. Look at that. We have eight uneducated workers there. Eventually we'll get schools. Uh, we'll get a fire department. What is this? This is garbage. We'll get like a trash center, healthcare, uh, fire departments. We have police and education and transportation. This one's kind of fun. You get to build bus routes and I think subways, I haven't gotten that far into the game yet. And we also have decoration, which are like parks and things like that too. So what do we have? This is like a marketplace. Oh, we have uh, competitors right next to each other. Yeah, that's great. What's this, a video store? Low density commercial building. Why don't you guys have water? You should. Let's check it out. Yeah, there's plenty of water going here. They just don't want to drink it. Uh, one of these is water and one is wastewater. So the wastewater is down here. That doesn't have power, although it should too. We'll pop that in. Gotta connect them. Okay, are you good now? Yep, he's got water. He's got power. Do you have power over here, buddy? You're powered, you're blue. That means you got power. Good. Oh, they got water now. Yes. And what is this thing? That is a quiet corner shop. It is actually on the corner. Cool, and ice cream. This is where I'd be at. Be all up in the ice cream shop. Oh, hello. What's your name? Tony. Oh, Tony disappeared. Greenway. He's at the Crescent Residence. Can I actually click on that and it'll take me to him? There's Tony's house. Aha. Local traders and business owners request more local manufacturing. Well, what does that mean? Check it out down here is our demands. We have very high demands for industry and offices as well as medium demands for commercial. Well, we have some commercial going on up here. It's not fully up, but they do want us to build some uh, industry. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's start. We need to pause it again. We're going to build some more roads. So we're going to do our same general uh, 2000 by 2000. We should have enough money for this. And if I come down here, 2000, where you is right there. And over this away. Oh, okay. Yep. Uh -huh. Then we can go up. And 2,000, and then over. Connect them. Good. And it looks like we did top and bottom. So if I come up here, it's too far. Right there, that's perfect. 
Not enough money. Okay. <laughs> I guess we don't get to make it right now. Uh, power should be fine if I connect over here. So let's do this. Is going to be my... Right now, it's going to be my industrial area. I could also do this as an industrial area. And then we need to run water over here yet, too. Ooh, man, that would have been close. It's too bad. Let's run you right here. Okay. And then we'll come you across. Oh, I don't have enough money. I'm out of money. Money, money. Perfect. So let's see if any industries pop up. There they are. Check that out. What kind of a building are you going to be? You are going to be the Goods Unlimited. Industrial building under construction. Oh yeah, this looks cool. It's got like a little smokestack going on. Next door we have Frank's Fish Stick Factory. I was just talking about getting fish sticks today. Slap a little butter on some bread, that uh, white bread, and put some nice fish sticks on there and get yourself a nice fish sandwich. I like it. I eat it all day. Actually, I haven't had it since elementary school, which was a long time ago, but it still sounds amazing right now. Look at this building. Oh, we got another smokestack going up. Isn't that neat? This game, it almost is like Instagram filter on it. Just really pretty. Once we get skyscrapers and junk going in here, it's going to be awesome. I'll be I'll be super pumped for it. So this is Frank's Fish Stick Factory. Uh, next to Frank's Fish Stick Factory. Must have bought two lots ready to wear. Oh, wow. Frank is really liking the fish sticks. <laughs> he owns one, two, three, four... Uh, oh, yeah, the box factory must be like a UPS. So Frank's Fish Stick Factory has moved in. Ice Cube Factory. That's awesome. Ready to wear. Box factory. Neat. So we're still uh, we're still kind of needing a little bit of uh, industry and offices. We are a little bit short on money, but people should be paying taxes once they can move in a little bit. Uh, this should be fine. We should have enough of the commercial for them. Plenty of residential area. Nobody is needing anything yet, right? Electricity is still good. Oh, this guy needs water. Whoops. Can we, we? I can't buy him any water. I can't take a loan out either until I level up a little bit. So we'll see what happens. Uh, let's speed it up. We should make some money. We can also raise taxes if I wanted to. But we're going up in the positive. You can see the red is getting smaller. Now we're making cash back. I understand that you're out of power. You're also thirsty. You're, you're out of thirstiness. And you're, you got power. All of our demands are minimum now. We should be starting to get more residential demands as these buildings get bigger and bigger. And look at this. This is my one of my favorite parts of the game is actually like the vehicles on the road. So this one, this is a sedan. It's actually owned by Mary Williams. Mary Williams is here. They're going in the sedan and they reside over here. So Mary in a little car, check this out. She's going home. Driving home. She's unemployed. That's okay. She'll get a job. There's a little scooter. Look at that scooter. Ha! That's Sabrina's scooter. Isn't that cool? Like, everything is kind of... Everything's linked. So you have all these workers, and, and they work at the different places. Here's another house going in. The high residence. Low density residential building. We can get higher density eventually. And that can be like uh, super duper urban areas, apartments, and that sort of fun stuff. So we'll have like a giant downtown area that'll list off really cool stuff. Sunspot activity. Is that a whale? No. It's a ship. We can eventually, we're going to get uh, big shipping areas out in the ocean. And we'll have the things come up in our, in our canals here. We'll have islands. Like maybe this island will be where our airport is, sort of things like that. I am so excited for this game. I am so pumped up and ready to go, and I am so pleased that we, we get to play it a little bit early, too. So I tell you what, guys, let's take a break for today, and, well, for right now, anyway. There'll be a second video coming up here shortly, so if you did enjoy this video and you'd like to see more, go ahead and stick around, and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.